Hello everyone, this is Pausta Fashion Workshop. I remind you that we post new videos every day. Today we continue working with the dress with the draping. Last time I showed you how to cut the details and how to tag the side detail to the main detail of the front. Today I'm going to show you how to make the draping itself. The first pleat should be made right on the bust level. Do not try to measure or calculate anything. Just distribute the fabric carefully. Pin it. The next pleat runs right to the shoulder. Notice how beautiful it is. It's okay. Fix it. The two pleats are ready. They are very beautiful. I want the next one to be right on the bust. Don't you think it looks good this way? This is how it should be done. The next one will be right below the bust level. It's useless to try to count the distance between the pleats. It's better to distribute the fabric straight on the figure. What about the next one? Try to pull on the fabric to make beautiful pleats. You can see that it doesn't take much time to do it. Make a pleat and pull the fabric a bit. The upper part of the draping is ready. I love the way these pleats look like. One, two, three, four, five. Do not forget about the lower part. These fabrics should also be distributed into pleats. Make pleats in any direction. Be creative. You can change the design however you want. You do not necessarily have to make exactly the same dresses. This is what I wanted to understand. The first pleat goes above the waistline. Do not forget to pull the fabric a bit. I love garments with draping. They look absolutely gorgeous. The girls in my fashion house know it, and they always laugh at me. Make the pleats however you want. The second pleat almost coincides with the first one here on the seam. It's okay. The most important thing is that you should pull the fabric a bit when pinning the pleats. By doing so, you'll make very beautiful pleats. There are some more pleats to be made here. There's something I need to change in the dress. I'll explain what. I want to make this pleat a bit bigger. They don't have to be even. Do not be afraid of anything. Learn the techniques. Improve your sewing skills. Practice makes perfect. I need to make one more pleat here. 
находиться, вот ей хочется вот так находиться. I'll pin it this way. This is how the drape looks like now. As I've said, this part should be altered a bit. This is what should be done. I remind you that this part of the dress was cut in a bias, so it's okay to change it. I've pinned the details according to this seam. Now you can see that this part should be cut. I'll do it later. First, I need to take the dress back onto the table. Next, I need to draw a line for stitching. I'll show you how to do it. I'll use a piece of chalk for drawing. Be very attentive, please. I need to take the pleats next. It's not easy to do it. I'll stitch the details according to this seam later. Be very attentive, please. Make sure that you fix the pleats strongly. If I have made the pleats on the table, the fabric would have sagged. Make sure to fix the pleats carefully and strongly. I will have to take the pins out before stitching the details. I want to not only make draping, I want to make a beautiful draping. You might have noticed that dresses with draping are usually very expensive. But now you can see that it's not hard to make them. You just need to be accurate, careful and attentive. I'm going to cut these extra pieces now. You can cut them after the next fitting. I've tacked the pleats. I'm going to tack the last ones right on the table. It's not convenient to do it now. Have a closer here. There's just small part of the draping to be tacked here. Let's have a look at the result. I've tacked the details and drawn all the needed lines. I can take the pins out now. I need to remove the taken I made on the waistline, the very first one. I 
Watch what I'm doing. I'm detaching the side detail from the main detail. I need to cut the extra piece from the draping. I want the seam allowance to be just one centimeter wide. Next, I need to take the side detail back. I can't wait for you to see the result. When the details are tacked, you need to stitch them, edge them with a novel locker, and then line. The lining should be very simple. You can see that the details match. Very nice. I'm going to take the details and then pin the front back to the dummy. I'm taking the side detail to the draping. I like this technique. Now you know how to make beautiful draping in the side detail. Have a closer here. If you want to make a dress tighter here, you can do it without any problems. Such dresses shouldn't be loose. They should be close fitting with a zipper and lining. In this case, the draping will look good. I was glad to show you this dress. I hope that it's clear now how to make the draping. Try sewing such dresses. Having such dress, you would never face a problem of having nothing to wear. That's all for today. Be different and beautiful. My name is Irina Paukšte. Subscribe to my channel, buy my courses, write comments, share the videos, press the like and the bell buttons. I would really appreciate your support. Thank you. Goodbye.